Today, we are going to have you try prison food from around the world. Oh, no. I think it's going to be very bad. OK, I'm excited. Prison is not meant to be a fun experience, and many countries try to spend as little money as possible on meals for prisoners while still hitting nutritional minimums. At least I know that they're still trying a little. Prisoners in Korea are often served kongbap, which is a bland dish of rice and beans for protein. They'll sometimes also get soup and kimchi to go along with it. I like kimchi. Kimchi is good. Is this spicy? It's a little spicy. And what are they? Is this the kongbap? The kongbap is the, kong bok? The, kong bok the rice and beans. Oh. Looks healthy. Mm, the rice is kind of dry. I can't dig my spoon into here. It's so hard. Mm, I prefer softer rice. Can I taste blandish? And the beans are like hardish. Very bland. <laughs> what putting about it being bland? Not that bad. Okay, the soup is good. Mm, so lucky. So you like this meal? Mm-hmm. It's not the rice and beans. There's an expression in Korean which roughly translates to, I'm heading off to eat rice and beans, which is what they say as, I'm off to the slammer. What's a slammer? I'm guessing jail. Yep. Have you ever had kimchi before? No. No, I have not. I've actually never heard of kimchi before. It looks very interesting. It smells like spicy trouble to me. I need to take my soup. I don't think I can swallow this. Spicy. Oh yeah, the kimchi is good. I would not want to go to jail if I had to eat kimchi. Super duper flavorful, but too flavorful for me. It's like lettuce, but with a ton of spice. Very bland, but the kimchi is very good. Ah, milk. I know what this is. This looks like paper. I assume I dip it in the milk? Wow. It's kind of looks crispy. Looks like wood. <laughs> So a popular breakfast jail food in Australia and the United Kingdom is a few bricks of Weetabix. Saying this is a brick is kind of very unappetizing. I like this. Tastes like paper. <laughs> I honestly thought I would hate it. It is not that bad. It tastes healthy. I'd rather drink the milk. Ah! It's kind of soaking up the milk, but also falling apart. The milk like, made it like so much better. It tastes the same, but moist now. Mm. It tastes like crunchy milk. To me, I don't like it with the milk. I like it just as bar soap. I'm already starting to get sick of it. So you couldn't eat this for breakfast every day? I wouldn't mind the milk. I think my dad would like this. He, he's like more open-minded and he loves cereal. This is literally the soggiest thing I've ever had. I put it in, it's just like, mm. Okay, so we have water. It smells like dog food. This is like, Ah! Wait a minute, is this mashed potatoes? So this is called Nutri-Loaf. Nutri-Loaf is a dish served to inmates who have misbehaved. Okay, I'm glad that this is not what my parents give me. It's a meatloaf of sorts that's filled with a blend of leftover foods that are baked into a nutritionally dense but often disgusting loaf. I'd much rather eat this. Uh, I'm feeling sick already. Look at this thing, guys. Look at this. Uh, uh. Ugh, I want to spit it out. Oh. 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 It was not good. Oh, my. That is something. 
it's tolerable, but it's not good, per se. I'm sweating. Ugh. The use of Nutriloaf is very controversial. There's a lot of people who say that it is cruel and unusual punishment. Yeah. I will agree with that, but it's not that bad. It's like fair, but also like very unfair at the same time. Cause like, it's like leftover food, like blended into like a meatloaf of some sort. I understand why they give this so that they'll never, ever, ever be bad again. Ooh, soup. Ah, fish too. What? Hey, fish. So one prison in Hokkaido, Japan has a restaurant on site where regular people can eat as the prisoners do. <gasps> what? This is ridiculous. Prisoners get it for free? And one popular meal in Japanese prisons is rice with mackerel, pickled vegetables, and miso soup. Hmm, I like miso soup. I absolutely love it. Um, so that's obviously 10 out of 10. Uh Oh, boom! Yeah. Very bland once again. <laughs> I like smell it in my mouth. Oh my. Oh. Okay. It's okay. Is that frozen water noodles? It tastes like nothing. <laughs> Is this cucumbers? Ah, oh, I like cucumbers. Cucumber is awesome. Hmm. I do very much like miso soup. This negative 10 out of 10. This one like, isn't very bland. The fish is well, well seasoned. All of the places we've been, I would rather be a prisoner in Japan than in Australia. So is this a meal you could eat every day? Mm -hmm. Well, if I'm a prisoner, I would definitely Prefer this over the gross loaf. McDonald's? McDonald's? Bro! Germany, you get McDoubles for your inmates. So finally, we have a McDonald's cheeseburger. At one German prison, they ran into an issue with their food supplier. So instead, they made a deal with a nearby McDonald's and fed their prisoners cheeseburgers and McToasts for a year. That's funny. One of my first times having cheeseburgers. Mmm. <gasps> Too cheesy. Mm. That's good. That is good, man. It's bready. I don't like the pickles, mayonnaise, ketchup. Other than that, 10 out of 10. Is this pizza sauce? No, I think that's ketchup. Could you imagine eating McDonald's and literally just a cheeseburger every day for a year? Every day? If all you were eating was McDonald's every single day, three meals a day, you would die in one month. They did deem that McDonald's did not suffice their nutritional needs, but only after a year did they switch back to regular food. <laughs> That's funny. I'm so jealous and so sad for them. I'm gonna go to jail in Germany. Free McDonald's every day of the year. We're gonna have you rank all of these. The one that you like the most, you're gonna give five points. Okay. And then go all the way down. Japan, five points. Five points. Japan, four points. Third is gonna be Japan. The Japanese food, five points. You guys deserved it. That was insane. I give Germany five points. Germany, four. Four points. Germany. Germany, three points. Three points for Germany. Korea, three points. Korea, I'll give you three. Korea, four. Korea, two points. Four points for Korea. Five points for Australia and the United Kingdom. Australia, two points. Australia, two. Australia's one point. And last, I'd give the Australia. United States, one point. Two points, I would give American food. Probably the US for two. America. One point! And then America negative quadrillion points. Overall, it wasn't that bad. I think the quality is good based on the fact that they spend low money. Except on America. Except on America. They're all like, not very good, but it's tolerable. For the people who eat wheat bricks, I'm sure that's kind of boring. Thank you guys so much for watching. What did you think of this episode? Comment down below. 
I thought food in jail is supposed to be all disgusting, crawling with ants and worms and cockroaches. They serve water, and then they also serve soup. My beloved soup, I love that.